Now at 5.30, a local man accused of sexually assaulting a day spa employee nearly a month ago is now off the streets. Thanks for staying with us. I'm Jackie Nesprall. And I'm Juwan Schroeder. Good evening. NBC 6's Steve Litz is in Dania Beach with how the community helped police track him down. Surveillance video captured the attack as it happened. A man, police say, sexually assaulting a spa employee. And according to investigators, Christopher Devlute is the suspect facing two counts of sexual assault. Fort Lauderdale Police Sergeant Deanna Greenlaw said the video was critical in solving this case. We received coverage from the media, so we were able to get our story out in the, in the community. They were able to see the footage, see this individual that we were looking for. Police say it happened inside the Angel Day. Day spa on Davy Boulevard in Fort Lauderdale back on September 5th. The police report says Dev Loot admitted going to the Angel Day Spa. However, his intent was to commit a strong arm robbery and denied forcing sexual advances on the victim. More surveillance videos of the suspect helped lead police to his arrest. Court records show he was seen on video at the spa on previous visits and on one occasion exposing himself to an employee. In early September, police released the video and surveillance pictures to the media seen by thousands of viewers all over the region. One was the owner of Health and Beauty Spa in Dania Beach, who recognized Devlute as a previous client. She called police. Somebody at his apartment building saw him on TV and also told police. Sergeant Greenlaw told me the suspect told the arresting officers he saw himself on TV. He, he spoke about saying, yes, I know, I recognize myself on TV. But at no point in time of recognizing himself on the surveillance footage and knowing he was wanted for this heinous crime, did he ever come forward? So it was that video, also the calls from the public and the traffic stop by the Hollywood police officers, all of that kind of came together and helped investigators get their suspect in custody. Reporting from Dania Beach, I'm Steve Litz, NBC6 News.